Hello everyone, welcome to this Windows channel and this is a uh, quick little look at different browsers and their memory usage. It's very interesting here. So I've uh, been looking at this uh, task manager and um, I've loaded in memory uh, Opera 41, uh, Microsoft Edge in the anniversary update, Internet Explorer 11, Google Chrome 55, and Firefox uh, 50, I believe, which are all the latest versions of each browser right now. And uh, one, one thing that stands out is that Firefox seems to be using more RAM than pretty much uh, all the other browsers. Google Chrome is uh, kind of third here at 78. Internet Explorer is the second most um, memory intensive, if you want, at 86. Edge is really the one that uses the least memory right now at 27.5. So it's kind of interesting. And uh, I think it's worth it to try out uh, maybe different pages. So let's, uh, let's move on to uh, therod.com here, for example, on different browsers. So here we're going to go to uh, therod.com. Therot.com, T H U R R O T T dot com. And each web browser, we're going to go to the same web page, T H U R R O T T dot com. And now let's uh, go to T H U R R O T T. TT.com. We we'll want to have this on every, every browser, making sure that every browser, so um, here's uh, Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, um, Firefox, Opera, and um, Internet Explorer. So this one has a more intensive uh, usage. So let's see here. What's the highest ranking in memory again. We have Firefox at 125 and Internet Explorer at 138 that are both very high usage of RAM. Then 78 for Google Chrome, uh, 69.6 for Opera, and once again Microsoft Edge still at 27.8, very, very low usage here. It seems to be uh, very efficient in what it's using. So it's, it's kind of interesting to see uh, these different browsers working. Uh, let's, you know, open another tab here and uh, this one opens to MSN, MSN Canada. Let's try it out with, uh, you know, MSN Canada. MSN.com brings you to MSN Canada for pretty much all browsers. So uh, let's uh, copy here. Uh, let's open a tab here to uh, pretty much paste MSN dot once again here on Firefox. Same here for uh, paste for Edge. And finally, uh, let's go to um, this one here, Chrome, paste. Let's check it out, and uh, here we go. We've uh, pretty much seen two tabs open, Torah.com, MSN Canada, which are heavy content pages. Uh, so all of them have both tabs open. Let's check it out here. Let's check it out with Opera. Let's check it out with Internet Explorer. Let's just check the task manager again. So now we've got the highest usage. Uh, clearly, Internet Explorer 11 is not good at, uh, at efficiency at 240 megabytes. Incredible. Um, Firefox, far behind though, but still, um, if, you, if you take out Internet Explorer, it's, it's the second one using the most memory here at 127 megabytes. Chrome. Uh, third, once again, at 78.6. Then we have Opera, 70.8. Kind of 
is maybe a little normal that both use close to the same amount of RAM because they use the same engine. And Microsoft Edge, only 33 megabytes. Pretty amazing when you look at that. So of course, like you, you know, I said, this is there's nothing scientific about this test, but um, I think it is an indication that with usage of Chrome isn't too bad actually. Um, not the best, but it isn't too bad, and it's surprising to see Microsoft Edge down there. Uh, really, really interesting. And of course, we'll be continuing tests. I will be uh, doing uh, speed tests of different web pages uh, also, and uh, I think that's going to be very interesting to see. So uh, clearly, Edge is a winner. Uh, Google Chrome always pretty much at the, in the third position, and. Um, Internet Explorer 11, one of the worst, basically, in memory usage. And Firefox, not that great, eh? So, uh, like I said, don't take this uh, too much as a scientific thing. It's not, but it's interesting to see how to use the RAM. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. Um, give us a thumbs up if you like the videos. If you have any comments, questions, maybe you have your own observations of uh, web, web browsers. Uh, please let me know. It's always interesting to uh, have your feedback. Thank you for watching.